So today, we're actually going to be playing in the skill shop because some of you guys actually wanted me to do this. I haven't done this in a long time, so I'm just going to hope that I do this properly so, and that you guys can enjoy it. We're going to be learning together. My name is Tim Mike, and I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Obviously, I'm no expert in skill shots, so we're going to be learning together. So hopefully I can teach you guys on what to do in certain skill shots. And hopefully, hopefully we can perform this well, you know. So with this, you obviously want to hit the Jaguar twice and make the Ice Queen go back and hit the Druid and hit it towards the Kong and the Shaman. Now, precision is key here, but I believe we can do it right here. And there you go. We were actually able to perform that and the Ice Queen is going to fish finish everybody off and of course the druid is going to help take out the highest health unit and that is going to be a perfect shot so we actually got we, we started off pretty strong here we're only going to be playing in in one token so i'm not going to be able i'm not going to spend a lot of tokens just to do this besides besides i'm in first place so this one i actually don't believe it's possible guys believe it or not i don't believe this is possible um a long time ago they actually nerfed the i believe they nerfed the orcs ability and now it doesn't trigger in certain situations so i don't think this skill shot is actually possible we're gonna try to do that and as you can see if the orcs ability would have activated it would have taken out the um well, both of them the barbarian and the jaguar so sadly i believe that this skill shot is actually impossible to do as of right now until they fix it or you know something i will believe that this sh uh, this one is impossible to do it in one shot. Oh, I did not mean to get out. Let's just continue on. So we got one, and then I'm pretty sure we got one that is pretty much impossible. So for here, you want the giant to hit the druid and just the druid. So, um, because then the giant will take out the, um, the goblin no matter what. You just need enough speed to take out the giant. So I believe this right here is enough speed. And of course... The Trian should also take out the Assassin right here. There you go. It was at just enough speed to take out the Druid right there. And of course, the Giant's ability was there to take out the Goblin. That was very good. Very good, if I do say so myself. Let's continue on. Let us continue on. So, let's see here. For this one, I'm actually a little, I'm actually a little confused on what you gotta do here. Let me see. So the robot has 35. I think the goblin, yeah, the goblin has enough damage to take out the the, the robot. But I'm just confused on what exactly you have to do here. Hmm. I'm probably not gonna be able to get it because I'm actually confused. Oh wait a second, was that enough? You okay? We we learned together. We definitely learned together. I did not expect that to work, and and it did. <laughs> it did. All right, so. I'm happy about that. Let's just continue on. So, okay, so with this, I've done this I've done this before. It's just a little bit difficult to perform. So you want to hit the wall first and then the orc. But the precision is actually tight. But I think here it will work. There you go. It actually worked. Okay. Can't complain about that right then and there. I'm happy that we actually performed that super well. We are doing really well. We're actually getting a lot of perf uh, perfect performance right here. So, Barbarian and Assassin. Alright, so you honestly want to hit the robot and push the Jaguar towards the Assassin. The thing is, um, the, the Jaguar actually requires two hits to be taken out. So, you want the Assassin to bounce back and hit the Jaguar again. Now, that's actually a little bit difficult to perform. But we're just going to hit it straight on and let's see if it actually works. The assassin did bounce back, but it missed the jaguar. So that was close. I was very close to uh, to performing it well, but sadly, um, I did fail. But that's okay. We'll just we'll just take the token right there. You guys know what to do. You just guys got to perform it. I just don't know the exact position on where to hit the robot to actually perform um, this shot perfect. You know. So with that being said, let's just continue on. I honestly don't know how much we're gonna do this. You know. I honestly don't know how much we're going to do. So with this, you want to... Let's see how much health does the robot and the jaguar has. 35, 35. 
Um. Wait, what about the orc? 45. Alright, so I think the trick is you want to hit the, the goblin towards the orc by bouncing off the wall. And make the giant hit both the robot and the jaguar and then the ability taking him out. I think that is key. We hit the jaguar, but we did not hit the robot. So I think we have the right play. I just did not perform that well. If you guys if you guys know where to hit the goblin to perform that perfectly, just let me know. But so right now I did not perform it perfectly. But we are learning together, of course. That's the most important part. We are learning together. So let's continue on. I mean, we have enough tokens, so we just continue on, you know. So Treant Assassin. All right. So you want to hit the assassin, both the jaguar. I'm not the jaguar. The giant and the orc. And make the treant bounce off the wall and then hit the barbarian. Now, easier said than done, but I think we can do it by doing it like this. There you go. And the treant actually hits the barbarian, making it a perfect shot right there. Nice one. Pretty good, if I do say so myself. So, let's continue on. Um, we're probably going to do like 15 or 20 minutes of this. Probably, probably a little bit longer. I just don't want to make this uh, too long of a video, you know. So with this, you gotta make the giant hit the jaguar, and then we have to make contact with the orc, I think, to then finish it off with the ability. Oh, we actually hit the goblin. We were supposed to hit the orc. Okay, so we were supposed to hit both of them. I only hit the goblin, but not the orc. So, sadly, we, we missed the perfect shot there, but that's okay. Like I said, we're learning. We're learning together. So, I mean, I can't be mad about this. I, and I hope you guys do enjoy what, uh, watching me do uh, Skillshot videos. I, I really do hope that you guys enjoy this. So with this, we gotta hit the wall and then hit the Jaguar towards the Assassin. And the Assassin hits the Giant while the Goblin bounces off and hits the Orc. Let's see if this angle will actually work. That was bad. That was so bad. That was very, very, very bad. Okay, that did not work out too well. I'm actually going to quit. I'm not going to perform it because we're probably going to have to do more than one shot to just take out both of them. So we're just going to take, uh, just keep the token. That was a very bad shot. Very bad. So with this, obviously, you got to let the assassin just bounce off everybody once, I think. I think you want the giant to hit the giant first and then the treant and then the Kong. But I think you can hit the Kong next and then the treant. But let's hit the giant right here. And then we should be able to hit the treant and then the Kong. We missed the Kong. Oh man. Alright, so we're not performing too well. But that's okay. We're learning. We are definitely learning. Sadly, we did miss the Kong. But that is a okay. We'll just do that just to finish it off. And let's see. Let's see if um if the next few we can actually get perfects because that's the like second in a row that we are missing. You know, that we're missing these skill shots perfectly. So there's actually a certain way to do this, but I actually do it a different way and it actually works. Like you honestly don't even need the treant at all, at least in my opinion. What you gotta do is hit the Barbarian and then make the, the Druid hit the Ice Queen and that's it. That's all you gotta do. And there you go. And then we'll just take out, the Druid will take out the um the Shaman. That's how I do it. But that's actually not the way that you're supposed to do it. You must use the Treant. <laughs> you must, you're supposed to use the Treant and I don't use him at all. I just use the Druid. So let's see. So, with this, you gotta make the druid hit the jaguar. If you can make the druid hit the jaguar, then it's good game. So, I think hitting it directly, it will work. Yep, and now... Oh, wow, we actually hit the shaman as well. We're um, The druid was supposed to take out the shaman, but... The ice queen helping out a little bit there. We didn't even need the druid at all. Of, of, other than, of course, um, hitting the jaguar. So, with this... You gotta hit the Jaguar at a certain angle, bounce the Barbarian towards the Assassin at this angle so it can hit the Orc, and then the Barbarian will hit the Robot finishing, finishing him off. I believe this is the angle to do it. Right here. 
Yes, it actually worked. All right, so there you go. Another one in the books. We are doing pretty well. Pretty well, if you ask me. Let's just continue on. So let's see. Sorry that I'm looking away. I'm just looking at my computer. So with this, you actually got, got to double hit the bar, uh, the goblin right here. And then make, make her bounce back and hit the jaguar and the orc. I believe right here should do the trick. There you go. It actually did the trick right there. We actually multi-hit a lot of troops right there. So there you go. We actually got the perfect shot right there in the books. Let us continue on right here. At any moment, you guys can pause a video. If I'm doing perfect shots, you guys can pause a video at any time. So that way you guys can see what angle am I using. So I usually don't do well here. Like not at all. Like I think I just need to hit the barbarian slightly so I can be pushed towards the giant and let the ability finish it off and then make the genie hit both the goblin and the jaguar. We missed the Jaguar, sadly, but we were able to take out... Wow, we actually did not even take out the, um... <laughs> the Barbarian. Okay, so I believe we can take both of them out. By doing it like this right here. Okay, we missed a, we missed a Barbarian, so we are just wasting tokens right now. Uh, not the greatest. <laughs> not the greatest, but it's fine. Like I said, we are learning together. We are definitely learning together. Let's just, let's, let's just finish her off right there. Just to get the five the five points. Well, obviously that wasn't perfect, but honestly it sucked. It took us it took us three shots just to finish that off. But it's okay. So is this the same one? No, it's different. Alright, so for here you actually do, do need to use a treant. So use a treant and then you gotta hit I think everybody. You gotta actually hit everybody. So let's do, I think right here should do the trick. Right here. There you go. We were actually able to hit everybody and the treant actually, oh no, we must, we needed the treant to actually hit the, um, the, the shaman. And we were actually able to do that because then the shaman would have survived with one health and the druid must take him out. Okay. Okay, so this should be easy, but obviously anything can happen. So, um, I think you gotta do this. Hit the druid first and then hit everybody else. Yes, the ability actually reached towards everybody, taking everybody out. Now, that should be an easy one. You just gotta go straight for the druid and then make the orc go down and just let the ability do its job. Pretty simple if you ask me. Let's just continue on. So for this, you got to, I think we got to hit the druid. It's 38, 19. Yeah, you got to make the, you got to make the giant hit the druid, not the assassin, just the druid. So I think, I think right here should, should be enough speed. I hope right here. Oh no, that was, that sucked. That sucked so bad. The ability did not even hit the, the assassin. Alright, so that was bad. So, of course, you need to put in more speed onto the giant so it can reach the druid. But that's all you gotta hit. You just gotta hit the druid. You don't need to hit the assassin. Because then the giant's ability will take out the assassin. So, that was a bad play on my part, but now you know what to do. So, let's just continue on. So, okay, so for here, you gotta double hit the druid hit the shaman once and then you gotta make the orc go back and hit the genie which is why double hitting the druid is necessary and there you go we were actually able to do it perform it super well right there another perfect shot in the books so um how, how much time I was, I was live i think i was live for 15 minutes let's do like another 10 15 minutes okay so we have done this before, but I honestly don't know if I can perform it again. It's actually the precision is actually very tight to do this. So I think right here should do the trick. Yeah, we actually performed it super well right there. So pretty good if you ask me. Another one, another good one. So let's just continue on right here. If you hear a collar, like a bell collar or something, sorry, it's actually, we're actually taking care of cats right now. And one of them has a collar and they're just roaming around. 
Okay, so we actually have done this before. I just don't remember exactly where I need to hit the goblin. So we're just going to hit it like this. So that way the goblin goes right. And hopefully we can take out everybody by doing this. Oh, yes, we were actually able to do that. Nice. We actually performed it super well. Another perfect shot right there in the books. Let's play another one. So let's see. All right, so I think this is the same one. Yeah, well, it's pretty much the same, just in different different positions. So you can make, you can hit the Kong, Treant, and then the Giant, or hit the Kong, then Giant, then Treant. I think trying to hit the Treant second is easier, but you might miss because the Kong is kind of heavy and it'll push the Assassin pretty hard. Yep. So we missed the angle, sadly, but so we might have to make the, the Assassin hit second. Or make the Assassin hit the Giant second instead of last. But like I said, we're learning. We are learning, ladies and gentlemen. So, how many have we done? I honestly don't remember. I'm just looking at the time. I just don't know exactly how, mi how much we have done. But, can't complain, right? Alright, so we have done this. I Actually, no, we have not done this. So, for this to work, you must make the goblin hit the wall twice. So for this, you gotta hit the goblin. Uh, you gotta hit the goblin right here. I'm just gonna assume that you gotta hit it right here, and then the giant will go towards the jaguar and the robot and take them out. There you go, and then the ability will go off. Bada bing, bada boom. Perfect. Like I said, guys, pause at any moment whenever I get perfect shots so that you guys know where exactly to hit it. And you can actually, um, you know, take a screenshot. And if you guys need a reference on how to perform certain skill shots, you can just take a screenshot, pause the video and whatnot, and um, and you can do it for yourself. Like like I said, I believe this is impossible. Impossible to do it in one try. Like if I push the Jaguar or push the Orc like this to make him hit both troops, we're going to miss the robot. That is the problem. So we're going to try to hit it right here and hope that the orc's ability will go off right here please go off no it doesn't go off like the whole port it's tough man because if you hit the orc straight towards the barbarian the jaguar the giant is going to miss the robot like that's the problem we'll just do this just to take both of them out i mean they need to fix it they need to fix it, that's for sure, because, like I said, I still believe this skill shot is impossible to do it first try. If you guys can actually do it in first try, just let me know. Just let me know. So, for this one, you got to hit the Kong towards, towards the Druid and make the Druid hit the Jaguar. And that way, we can get the, the win right here. So, I think this is the angle that we got to hit it. Wow, we actually hit the, the Shaman as well. The Druid actually hit the Shaman as well, and that was honestly unnecessary. But we actually pulled it off right there. So, pretty good if you ask me. Pretty good. So, let's see right here. Alright, so we got to make... Alright, so we got to push the Giant towards the Assassin. That's for sure. Push the Giant towards the Assassin. And then we got to make the druid or hit the druid and maybe even the goblin. I'm confused on how to do this. I'm just going to hit it like here. And hopefully it actually works. Oh, oh, snap. All right. That actually worked very well. That actually worked super well. So if you guys need help, just do what I did. Remember, you can pause at any time and just take a picture. And then you can you can perform like that. I cannot believe that actually worked. All right, so for this one, I think we gotta we gotta make yep yeah, we gotta make the giant hit both of them. We gotta make the giant hit both of them. And I think we gotta hit the wall first and then the jaguar. I think. I cannot believe that actually worked. Actually, I think the goblin, the goblin was actually able to hit the the jaguar in first shot. Without the wall, I believe. And it worked out. It worked out super well. I think I've done like 40 skill shots. I'm not sure. 
So for this one, what I do here is we got to touch the, the treant and then we got to double hit the, the shaman and then the ice queen. But the double hit on the shaman is necessary. So I believe right here, there you go. We actually perform the shot and then Drew will take out the barbarian right there for the win. Not too shabby, if I do say so myself. All right, so let's do let's do five more. Let's do five more skill shots. So Barbarian goes next. All right, so we got to hit the Goblin and the Jaguar. And then we got to hit the Jaguar at a certain angle so I can go left towards the Orc. So I believe, I believe right here should do the trick. Yes, it actually worked. All right, right there should do the trick and it did. Cool beans. It worked out super well. All right, so let's do four more. We actually have over 200 points. <laughs> I played a lot of skill shots. Thankfully, I'm only doing uh, one, not 10. All right, so for here, you got to push the assassin downwards, make him wall bounce, hit the orc and the barbarian, make the tree and hit the giant. So I believe right here should do the trick right here. We missed the barbarian. That was so close. We missed the barbarian. Um, I don't know if we're going to be able to actually hit the Barbarian towards the Assassin just to get the extra points, but we're going to attempt it anyway. We just need to push the Barbarian towards the Assassin right here. We just completely missed it. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to quit. That was a waste. Waste of a token right there, but that's fine. I was very close to performing it, so you, just, you guys just need to adjust it just a smidge to the... Either left or right. I, I don't remember. Left or right. And you guys will hit the Barbarian. So for this one. We have done this one, right? So you gotta hit the Jaguar right here. And then make the Barbarian hit the Assassin. So I think right here should do the trick. Yes, it actually worked out. Let's go. That was pretty good, if you ask me. So let's do two more. Let's do two more. Let's continue on. Goblin. All right. So this is a little tough. Not gonna lie. This is a little tough. So you gotta hit the robot like around here and then make the goblin wall bounce and hit the shaman and the orc. Um, it is a little bit tough because the robot is kind of heavy than the goblin. So the goblin will get a bounce like pretty hard bounce. I think right here should do the trick. We missed the shaman. That was so close, but we missed the shaman. But you saw me I was so close to hitting the shaman right there. But you guys can perform it. Um a little bit. You just got you guys just gotta adjust it and you guys will get it. You guys will get it easily. And all we are missing, let's just do one more. We're gonna do one more. And uh we'll see if the last one will get a perfect shot for you guys. Hopefully we'll get a perfect shot. And let's see what we get. Alright, this is this is kinda easy. So just gotta hit the the orc. Let's see, hit the orc right here. Hit the orc right right here. Bada bing, bada boom, bada bam. All right, there you go. And that was the perfect shot. And we're just gonna end the video there with a perfect shot. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. And if you did, please make sure to hit the like button down below and subscribe to the channel for more Smashing Four videos. I haven't done this in in about five months and I actually had a good time doing it so if you guys once uh, want to see more skill shot videos just let me know and I'll certainly do it for you guys they do need to add more more um more skill shots I guess you could say because we keep getting the same ones over and over and it's getting a little bit boring then again I cannot perform sometimes I cannot perform perfect skill shots so there's that uh, so next week we're next week we're gonna be doing some hyper boosting videos you I got like three or four um, request to do hyper videos for you guys so just stay tuned for that and of course if you guys have any challenge tech videos that you want to see just let me know and of course if you guys want to see ladder pushing videos with any deck just let me know and I'll certainly do it for you guys thank you so much for watching this video and thanks again for your continued support I will see you in the next one take care